Hey there, and welcome to a short tutorial series on the Redemption MMO Minecraft server. Today we'll be covering some basic commands just to walk you through and get you started. Um, everything we cover here today is going to be fairly short and simple. Let's start with some basic stuff. Alright, so if we come over here, we'll just pick a random spot. You can see that we have, first of all, the slash spawn command. And by using slash spawn, we'll be teleported to the starting point of the server, this gold block here. Great! We've achieved that. As you pass by there, the menu will pop up. You can access this as well by typing slash menu. And that'll bring it up. There's several options here, and we'll, we can go into... Uh, some more in-depth detail on what all of this is a little later on another tutorial. And here we've got some more stuff. I'll take you on a walkthrough of the spawn area in another video. Look forward to that coming very soon. We're going to pop up down over here. And what we're going to do here is we're going to go ahead and demonstrate the slash set home command. Oh, we're still on spawn, so we've got to go, got to go a little further out, a little further out, a little further out, a little further out. We got some buildings here, so we could probably pop on down over here and go ahead and use slash set home. Home is set to current location. Okay. So now, if we do slash spawn and return to spawn, we'll be back at spawn, and then we can type slash home, and you can see I have multiple homes. Um, you can earn multiple homes on the Redemption MMO Minecraft server by using your daily votes, um, and every 25 votes that you form you'll earn another slot for another home and I'll demonstrate that for you here shortly so we'll just go home home and that brings us back to the slash set home that we just set now let's say we didn't like the position of that home we're going to go ahead and go slash del home H-O-M-E, all one work, no space, hit enter, and you can see that it uh, asks you for the uh, the name of that home. So the home that we just set was a basic home, and you'll be starting with that one, and it'll just be named home if you don't add anything to it. So we're going to go ahead and delete that slash, or that slash home that we just set by doing slash del home. And let's say, okay, I, I've decided that this is a much better area. So we could do slash set home. And then we can actually input a name after this. So we could say, larg near spawn. And then our home will be set to that location. So if we go to slash home, and it'll actually pop up in my list. And let's... Go ahead and slash home and you can actually use tab to go ahead and auto complete that just like you can with any other players names uh, or any such item which is great so now you can see we teleported to blarg near spawn and we're going to just go ahead and delete that home one more time that's del home blarg near spawn and we deleted that just dandy that's beautiful all right so let's go ahead and go back up to spawn for safety now i'm going to go ahead and uh message a nice friendly player here on the server and we're going to demonstrate the direct message system so dms or private messages pms and let's redo that with slash msg 
and then the player name will give corrupt a shout hey man what's up and hopefully he'll respond to that real quick here give him a sec he might be in the middle of a fight outside there we go and then we can actually respond to that using slash r and you can actually shorten the slash msg with slash m and it performs the same function just like that oh i tried to message busy busy does not exist so just like that slash m player name so we'll slash m correct and we'll try to send it that way and that will actually function properly <laughs> okay so uh, and, and let's uh move along here you can if if say for instance there's no moderator on which typically there is it's quite it, it's getting to be quite busy on the server here and uh as so so not not all the time but most of the time there's moderator on however if someone's just bugging the ever living heck out of you and you you just can't take it anymore you can use slash ignore and input the player name and once you do that you will stop receiving all those messages from that player let's move on to say your friend is offline and you don't use discord or whatever um, you can actually send a mail using slash mail send and the player name And that will send them the following message after the send. So that again, that was slash mail send your message. Just like that. And to read your messages, you'll notice that you have one messages has been popping up. You do slash mail read to view your mail. And you can see correct says hello. And then you do slash mail space clear and that will empty your mailbox so that's a good way to communicate if your friends are offline and you don't have say uh say your steam readily available say you're not friends on steam or or not you, you don't have discord available to you or some such for some reason or another it's a good way to communicate off uh when, when your friends are offline um, we also have access to the slashback command. So say I let, let's let's go ahead um, and, and and use slashback, and that should take us to the last place that we teleported from, which should be where I had set that previous home space. So in that home list, I deleted that home. I forgot where I was. I need to get back there because I deleted the home, and maybe I died after I deleted the home. I got just smashed on by a bunch of mobs just got destroyed and i needed to get back there to grab my stuff you still have that availability um if you had uh, forgotten something maybe left some items in a chest and had deleted that home you can use that slash bag to get home so let's go ahead and go back to spawn real quick here and let's uh let's go on to uh teleports you do have access to a couple basic teleports and We'll go ahead with uh, and we'll uh, send a request to correct and maybe he'll let us uh, let us pop over to him real quick just so that we can show this off so I sent off the command which is slash TPA space space the player name and if he's in a safe spot 
Uh, maybe I should bust out my sword real quick. Oh, and there he uh, he accepted the request, and here we are. And that teleport came through. So, and I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna go back to spawn. Neato, neato. And now you can actually request in, in the reverse way. You can use slash TPA here, H E R E, space the player name. And you can actually request them to teleport to you. And there he accepted the request. Oh, and there he is. Poof. And there he goes. And you can cancel those requests just like it says there to cancel the request. You can type slash TPA cancel. Um, uh, just in case you end up getting uh, uh, mobbed by a bunch of bunch of baddies start mobbing you um, you can slash TPA cancel and that'll cancel that request which is handy in some instances maybe you don't want your buddy to die and now if I teleport back to my bed fancy big pretty bed we can actually uh, fly on out Check out my horses. And then uh, he should TP to me. Any second he'll 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 send a he'll send a request through, just like I did for him. Give him a sec. Give him a sec. Any sec now. See, there it comes. And right there, correct has requested to teleport to you. Uh, to teleport, type slash TP accept or slash TP deny. So if you deny them, it'll just leave them there and it'll tell them that, they, that you denied the request. Um, you have 120 seconds to decide. That's full two minutes, plenty of time. So if we go ahead and slash TP accept, It'll say teleport request accepted, and then just like it did for us, on the other side, it'll say wait, stand still for three seconds, and your teleport will commence. And then three seconds passes, he TPs to us. Lovely jubbly. Our sporting buddy, such a good sport, helped us out. say thanks and I think that covered yep that's all the commands for today so I'm gonna go ahead and chop this video up and it should be coming out oh well when you see it well that's all for today folks thanks for joining us good chap correct here helping us out thanks so much yeah buddy Thank you, thank you. And we'll see you next time in the next episode. All right. Laters.